family welcome back to my channel my name is Michelle Anna if you are here for the first time welcome welcome to my channel in today's video it's going to be a curly hair video I'm gonna be trying out two new products that I'm going to talk about a little bit further as the video goes along but honestly these are the results and I feel like they did very well for my hair so if you guys are interested in this type of video just keep on watching so my hair is a mess right now but we are going to fix that today i'm going to show my curls some love i'm going to try some new products out for the first time and just walk you through what it would look like to actually treat my hair with a new product and that new product is the palmer's natural fusions lavender rose water conditioner the first step i actually take when i decide that i'm going to add a treatment to my hair is pretty much to do the treatment first now that's a little bit reverse to what a lot of people do and the reason being is because for me if I do my treatment after I conditioned wash shampoo whatever I do that day co-wash what happens is it weighs my hair down I think that for me what has worked the best is to do the treatment first shampoo it out um, allow the treatment or conditioner or whatever to really penetrate into my hair follicle so that it adds the moisture that it needs these are things that really just worked for me and I just have repeated it and I've gotten great results so I'm gonna pretty much part my hair and then use my curie do to really open up my hair follicle make sure that the product is ready to be received into my hair and give it all the lovely nutrients that it needs so like I said I have not used this before but I went to their events to the Palmers and then and they gave me they gifted me the whole line actually and so I was like I really need to try this because I've seen some great results and I could really use some hydration right now my hair is like this as a result of me in my fitness workout journey if you're not following me on Instagram make sure you're following me I've been documenting my 30-day challenge kind of thing this is what happens when you brush your curls out and so I mean it's not terrible but we need to show the curls some love today so I'm going to part my hair do what I do it doesn't have to be perfect let's take a clip steam is coming out so what I'm doing with this is just kind of raking it through my hair twist this open I'm just gonna put some on my I'm very generous when it comes to stuff like this, by the way. It says to start on the end. It smells really good, like really like fresh. And if there's like little, if you see little white stuff in my hair, it's definitely the product that I use. Just probably like a gel to, you know, lay my edges down. And boom. Next step is to pretty much leave it on for like five, 10 minutes or even longer, depending on what you're doing in between. And put the plastic over your head. Okay, this looks funny. All right guys, so I have taken the product out of my hair. This is how my hair looks with no product. It's not dry or anything. Obviously like when it's wet versus when it's dry it looks so, so different. So the product doesn't have as much slip as I would like. But I do definitely feel a difference in my hair. Not like drastically or dramatically, but I do feel a difference, which is always a good thing. The styling products that I'm going to use, um, I'm going to start off with the Widad Advanced Climate Control Styling Cream. This I have used in the past, but the product that is new that I have not used is the Advanced Climate Control Heat and Humidity Gel. This is one of the new products that they just added to their advanced climate control line so i'm trying it out it does have a stronger hold so i'm probably not gonna use too much of it but maybe in the areas that i really want a stronger hold i'm typically super generous with the cream uh especially in the areas where like i get a lot of frizz which is like right in the crown area sometimes i do section my hair out Today, I'm just literally going to do this because it's just how I'm feeling. All right, so I'm focusing a lot in that crown area. And I'm going to start bringing hair forward because I do like when my bangs are 
forward. So I want to take the new product that I have not tried yet and I'm going to just start with a little bit because I know that this has a stronger hold than the other one and I'm not really looking for a super hold but what I am going to do is mainly put it in the front. And the back right here in the crown area. I'm gonna get a little bit more for this area of my head. This is like a little bit. That's easy. You just take a pick on day two or three or whatever and just pick it. And guys, if you don't have access to a microfiber towel, just use a t shirt. I have a bunch of them, but. Honestly, like sometimes I just end up grabbing a t-shirt and it works perfectly fine. And honestly, it just already starts kind of working with it. This is typically where I figure out where my part is going to be. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and let this fully air dry. I'm going to put my face on. I'll probably come back to you guys in a couple of hours when it's at least 90% dry so you guys can see the definition, what it looks like. So my hair is about actually like 80% dry. It's still a little bit damp like in the back area. But I wanted to do natural lighting right quick because I um, scrunched my hair again. I did what they call breaking the cast, which is pretty much like when the product is in your hair and you're not touching your hair at all, you kind of let it dry and you kind of just scrunch it and you're like breaking the cast. Like, I don't know how to explain it, but you're basically taking out the, the not the crunch, like that's put so badly, but like the hardness of um, what the product creates, you're basically scrunching it and you're allowing your natural fluff to come alive so that's really what i did and i kind of just really like the natural lighting so i wanted to show you right quick what the natural lighting looks like all right so these are the final results of my hair with the products used today i feel like my curls are super oh, what's the word i'm looking for plumpy that's the word I'm looking for. Plumpy, y'all. What in the... I mean, I got this one straggler back here, but it's okay. I can tuck him in. Oh, my goodness. I did not fluff. I didn't do anything to it. I didn't pick it out. This is just exactly how it dried. I left it alone other than, like, what I said earlier, breaking the cast, and that's it. So now, like, just playing around with it as the days go on, it just ends up growing and growing and growing. Well, cheers to a good experience with the new product. So if you guys want to check out the products, it's a go for me. Um, at first, I was a little like concerned about the Natural Fusions conditioner because of the lack of like that nice slip that I like. But it did your girl well. well. Thank you so much for watching this video today. And if you liked it, just give it a thumbs up and make sure you're subscribed if you're not already subscribed. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Mwah.